tend to agree with that. Is that worth it to you? Well, I mean, is it worth it to me now? No. But I think at the same time, my grandmother raised me the way she wanted me to be raised. And I feel like I'm comfortable. And I can sit here and stand and sit here and say that she did a great job. Whether other people think so or not, that's their opinion. Mm -hmm. um, but other than that, you know, my family, first and foremost, that's, that's the most important thing to me. Let me be completely fair to you by asking you this very sensitive question. It's your business, it's your family. I'm going to ask you this. When you talk about your grandma and how she raised you, isn't it fair to say that the number one thing she would want for you is for you to be happy? And if the truth has contributed to making you unhappy because it's left you without the game that you love, was it worth it? I would say, yeah, I mean, I may be unhappy, but I mean, to say, would I be happy if I didn't tell the truth? No, I'm not saying that, I'm not saying the lie. I'm saying not to say Where certain things. I'm not saying a lie. I'm just saying to keep it in the house. Well, I mean, again, I, I never grew up to be politically correct. Okay. If that's what you're asking. Mm -hmm. um, I never knew that term. I never knew really what that meant, you know, as I, as I, it's funny. In, you know, my early years started mm -hmm. 